We are less than two weeks away from Election Day, and the FBI says there's been an attempt to sway voters. What kind of information did they get and how? We're getting answers from the experts. We have confirmed that some voter registration information has been obtained by Iran and separately by Russia. In a rare press conference Wednesday night, U.S. intelligence officials tell the American people there's been an attempt to disrupt the upcoming presidential election. Both countries were able to gain access uh, to U.S. Uh, uh, voter registration uh, information. Gary LaFord is a retired lieutenant colonel with the U.S. Army and taught international business at American International College. We asked him if this information is easily accessible to anyone. Personal data, no. Uh, that is generally supposed to be secured <clears throat> at both the state and, and, and federal le uh, level. Uh, but uh, China, Russia, Iran have very, very sophisticated um, uh, cyber attack uh, structures. Uh, that, that really have allowed them to some extent, uh, you know, infiltrate uh, into our uh, into our database. LaFord explains to Western Mass News how foreign countries are using this information. The idea is to gain access, you know, through watching U.S. news, uh, watching the uh, the disputes, the issues, and then playing off on that uh, through uh, misinformation as far as the uh, the internet goes, emails, social media. He says it's not just Russia and Iran, but China is also involved. In the case of Russia, their information uh, campaigns tend to be directed more towards supporting Trump uh, than the, the Biden administration, because they would see the Biden administration as probably more uh, any uh, Russia establishment oriented. In the case of China, certainly when you look at the trade wars between the United States and in, uh, in, in China, you also um, look at the the pandemic and uh, this administration has strongly accused uh, China as being responsible for it. Then certainly the misinformation campaigns that you see coming out of China would certainly favor a, uh, a Joe Biden win. As for the FBI, we will not tolerate foreign interference in our elections. The fort says if you do get an email that you don't recognize, don't open it. He says if you get something that seems inappropriate for an election campaign, you should contact authorities.